25 Dog Care Tips for Pet Parents As a dog owner, you may adore your pooch as if it were your own flesh and blood. And just like your children, you want to ensure you provide the best care possible so your dog can live a happy and healthy life. If you're striving to be an excellent pet parent, here are some dog care tips to help you along the way. Number 1. Monitor Food Consumption According to the most recent statistics from Banfield Pet Hospital, which operates more than 1,000 veterinary hospitals throughout 42 states, more than one-third, 34%, of dogs have been identified as fat. The growth from 2011 to 2020 is 108%. Unfortunately, overweight dogs are more likely to experience health problems like inadequate immune systems, metabolic abnormalities, and cardiovascular disease. Even though you might want to reward your pet, Refrain from feeding them too many treats. Number 2. Provide sufficient water throughout the day. All canines must have access to fresh clean water throughout the day. To prevent bacteria from growing on food and water dishes, be sure to refill the water supply and wash all of them. Number 3. Regularly groom your dog. Grooming your pet frequently keeps them clean and pest free. Some dogs only require a bath every few months, whilst others require routine maintenance. If your dog sheds, you should brush it frequently. Also necessary is nail cutting. Failure to cut your dog's nails might result in health issues like torn tendons and malformed feet. Number 4. Schedule annual checkups with your vet. One of the best ways to keep your pet healthy is to visit the vet regularly so they can examine your dog for any health concerns. Number 5. Look for solutions for flea tick and heartworm prevention. The health of you and your pet is at danger because fleas and ticks can spread illnesses including Lyme disease, plague and Rocky Mountain Spotted Fever. Your dog's lungs, heart, and arteries could be harmed by heartworms. Discuss preventative measures, including as topical and oral drugs, with your veterinarian. Number 6. Maintain proper vaccinations. The body of your dog is shielded against contagious diseases by vaccinations. Parvovirus, distemper, rabies, and canine hepatitis are typically included in standard canine immunizations. You could also require a vaccination against Bordetella bronchiseptica, which can cause kennel cough, if you groom or board your dog. Your veterinarian can advise you on the vaccinations that are right for your dog. Number 7. Consider spaying or neutering your pet. Pet population control isn't the only reason to spay and neuter animals, it can also shield your dog from certain illnesses. For instance, spaying your female dog can reduce her risk of breast cancers and uterine infections. Male dogs who are neutered are less likely to get prostate and testicular cancer. Number 8. Brush your dog's teeth. While often overlooked, dental care is also essential for maintaining your pet's health. Regularly brushing your pup's teeth can help prevent dental illnesses that can end up affecting your dog's kidney and liver function. Dental cleaning might also be recommended, but it can cost a few hundred dollars to one thousand dollars, depending on your location. Some pet insurance companies, such as Lemonade Pet Insurance, sell add-ons to help offset the cost of dental care, including routine dental cleanings. Number 9. Exercise your dog every day. Healthier bones, joints, muscles, and organs are promoted by regular exercise. Additionally, walking helps reduce monotony and stimulate the mind. Incorporate your pet into your workout routine by having them run around the backyard, trek, or climb stairs. While different breeds and sizes of dogs require varying amounts of exercise, setting up a routine for both of you to go for walks is crucial. Number 10. Challenge your dog's brain. Mental stimulation is good for man's best companion. Create puzzles, play new games, and teach your dog new tricks. Dogs adore using their noses to explore because they have a keen sense of smell. To help your dog find the treats, try hiding them throughout the house. Number 11. Create a slow pace meal time. Some canines enjoy devouring their meals in one swallow. However, eating too soon can lead to nausea or digestive problems. Your dog's eating pace should be reduced. At lunchtime, think about using a puzzle feeder or putting a tennis ball in their bowl so they have to eat around it. Number 12. Register your pup. Dog owners are frequently required to register their pets under state and local pet laws. To be sure your dog has the appropriate license, check with your neighborhood governments. To show that your dog is registered in the event that it goes lost, you should fasten the license to its collar. Number 13. Consider a microchip. A microchip can help you find your dog if it goes missing. Microchips can be implanted painlessly and store your contact information. In most cases, veterinarian clinics and animal shelters can scan them. The cost of microchipping is covered by some pet insurance policies.
Number 14, Secure Trash, Chemicals and Toxins Around Your Home Although dogs are naturally curious creatures, their curiosity can occasionally put them at danger of harm or sickness, especially when they are exploring your home. Secure your trash, poisons, and other chemicals you find about the house to keep your dog safe. Number 15, Create a safe space for your dog, under some circumstances, such as the sound of thunder or boisterous house guests, dogs may experience anxiety or worry. When your pet wants to escape, making a safe area for it can give it protection and comfort. Have a spot in your house with a bed, a blanket, some toys, and some fresh water. Number 16, Clean Your Dog's Stuff Cleaning your dog's toys, blankets, and bedding will get rid of germs, pollen, and other irritants. Make sure to regularly wash your dog's bedding if you have one because some canines experience seasonal allergies. Number 17, keep food out of your dog's reach. Dogs are poisoned by foods like avocados, chocolate, and onions. Keeping these things out of their reach can prevent some very negative health effects. In general, you shouldn't feed your dog human food. However, your veterinarian can advise certain people food items, like as plain chicken, plain rice, and canned pumpkin, for particular conditions such digestive disorders. Number 18, use a leash while in public. In public areas, you should always keep your pet on a leash to prevent mishaps and harm. For instance, your dog may be in danger of being hit by a car if it chases after a squirrel after spotting it. Number 19, prioritize one-on-one -on -one time with your pup. Dogs thrive when their owners show them love and affection. Making time for daily pet encounters helps to improve your relationship. You can do this by stroking, entertaining, and rewarding your dog with treats. Number 20, practice patience and consistency. It takes a lot of persistence and patience to train a dog. Dogs are sensitive to negative energy, so if they detect your agitation or anger, they might not work as well. Ask your veterinarian for advice or speak with a professional if you're having trouble training your dog. Keep in mind that training your dog will take some time, the rewards will be worth the effort. Number 21, consider positive reinforcement training. Positive reinforcement training involves rewarding your pet for appropriate behavior while disregarding inappropriate conduct. This form of training boosts your dog's self-assurance, promotes cooperation, and fosters tolerance. Additionally, it can strengthen your relationship with your dog. Number 22. Monitor your pet's time outside. The ears, paws, and tail of your dog may become frostbitten in the winter due to the bitter cold. Heat can dehydrate your dog and lead to heat stroke throughout the summer. Make sure to monitor the weather and restrict your dog's time outdoors during severe weather. Number 23, pay close attention to your dog's paws. During the winter, ice and salt can cause cracks in your pet's foot pads. Hot asphalt or concrete can burn you and hurt you throughout the summer. To protect your dog's paws, think about using booties or try walking in the grass. Number 24, steer clear of toxic algae. Your dog could become seriously ill if they come into contact with water that contains harmful algae while hiking, walking, or even exploring your land. For information on bodies of water that can contain toxic bacteria or other contaminants that could hurt your dog, contact your local parks and recreation department. Number 25, avoid leaving your pet in a hot car. Never leave your dog unsupervised in the car. Even if you think the weather outside is comfortable, temperatures can quickly reach dangerous levels putting your dog at risk for serious illness or death. The temperature inside your car can increase by 20 degrees in just 10 minutes, according to the American Veterinary Medical Association. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment and ring that bell.